hi everybody so today we are going to learn how to make a new program in fano program so for that generally we are having here the one key select we have to press the select it shows the directory where the all the programs are there so after selecting there is the preview and next key you are able to see uh, what uh, is going to be there uh, if i am pressing the next it's uh, the first one is type so type all program collections tp programs carol programs macro conditions which type of program you want to see uh, enter here so now these are the tp programs and uh, if i press here another uh, second option is create sometimes if it not come there it's uh, maybe there is coming detail so that time you have to press the tv key or the next key so i am press the next and uh, there is one option uh, comes to f2 create as you know create means uh, making the one program create that teach pendant program so uh, what's the name you want to uh, write the here the name word upper case lower case and the option option uh, you uh, can also select the keyboard and uh, i am uh, interested to write by upper case so i write a b c and make enter and again enter so now it's uh, showing the program details so it's the name what i write you can also change from there if you uh, not like okay if uh, now this is the command you can write here the command for what program uh, purpose you are using for uh, spot welding for mig welding these uh, this is the group mask so this is uh, the group 1 this is the group 2 if you want to know don't use the group 2 that means you have to make it star if you want to use make it 1 if you don't interested to take any group just only have a logical program so you can make both star if i am selecting one that type that means only group one movement is recorded group two uh, movement is not recorded so i select the ball because my robot is spot welding robot which is having the external axis is the gun so uh, fifth one is the right protector if i make it on nobody able to uh, touch up or make any modification in this program until unless if it's uh, make it off after making it off only able to uh, write overwrite the program and uh, after completion this uh, this is the ignore of the pause stack size and uh, here is the one selection end now abc program is open so uh, now you can see uh, now we are inside the program and we are having the options so first one is the point uh, in which we are able to take the joint point and linear point second one is the spot my robot is spot welding so it's showing the spot option if you want to take the spot point you have to just directly press the spot and uh, third one is the gun touch up arc touch up auto touch up touch up and uh, mask of mask em dc so ed cmd enable editing commands uh, generally we are telling these so uh, first one is the insert how many lines you want to insert delete if you want to delete copy paste find replace remember comment undo remark these options are there generally we are uh, first one we use insert insert how many lines you have to insert generally i take the 10 lines in advance so first two 10 lines we there before uh, this is a only in fano robot before making any program you have to define before taking the motion point the user frame and u tool number it's necessary otherwise sometimes uh, somebody change the util number you are not able to run your program it's showing the alarm i i will show practically so first of all uh, during uh, doing the program in fanuk you have to set the user frame or u tool number so here i am having the instruction one uh, this is the instruction 
कि हेयर इज द ऑप्शन एज यू कैन सी इंस्ट्रक्शन स्पॉट वेल्डिंग रजिस्टर आई ओ इफ आई वट एवर आई वॉन्ट टू टेक इन माई प्रोग्राम आई कैन टेक फ्रॉम दे आर यू आर एबल टू सी विच ऑप्शन वी आर हैविंग टू यूज इन अवर प्रोग्राम सो आई हैव टू टेक ऑफ साइट ऑफ फ्रेम्स आई प्रेस द इंटर एंड हेयर यू कैन सी द यू टूल नंबर सो यू टूल नंबर विच टूल यू आर यूजिंग जनरली वी आर यूजिंग द वन नंबर एंड मेक इट इंटर एंड ऑल्सो इन द सेम वे यू हैव टू सेलेक्ट द यूजर फ्रेम नंबर इट्स अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट बिफोर मेकिंग यूर प्रोग्राम फर्स्ट इनिशियली यू हैव टू टेक द यूजर टूल एंड यूजर फ्रेम नंबर मैनी टाइम्स आई सी नो बॉडी टेक दिस वन एंड सफरिंग फ्रॉम द प्रॉब्लम सम बॉडी चेंज द टूल नंबर इन फ्यूचर एंड ड्यूरिंग द रनिंग टाइम इट्स शोइंग मिसमैच ऑफ द टूल नंबर यूजर फ्रेम नंबर मैनी पीपल सफरिंग फ्रॉम दिस प्रॉब्लम सो इट्स गुड previously you write the u tool number user frame number and uh, press the dead man and read this uh, now at the time what are the uh, coordinate press you can see shift plus coordinate i will press and see u tool number is two is selected there so i have to select one so again you press shift and coordinate key you are able to see now user tool number is one and user frame number is जीरो सो आई हैव टू इफ आई वॉन्ट टू राइट हेयर जीरो आई हैव टू मेक इट जीरो नाउ माई प्रोग्राम इज गोइंग टू बी राइट इन यूजर टूल नंबर वन ए यूजर फ्रेम नंबर इज जीरो सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई टेक वन इनिशियल पोजिशन प्रीव्यू प्रेस द प्रीव्यू ऑन नेक्स्ट की वन मोशन पॉइंट ज्वाइन आई विल टेक माई रोबोट इज स्टैंडिंग Uh, one constant position like that home position i take this point now i jog the robots uh, by where i want to take the robot to do the work i take the another point same i take another point same if i want to take some logical point i have to take the instruction and uh, if i want to wait wait for input so there are the options wait here didio i want to wait di means 45 number uh, which one on off i have to wait for on i am putting like that after reaching this position i am wait and also you want to take there one point linear you are able to take the linear point and like that you are able to make your program continuously and uh, bring back after completion your uh, robot work you take it to home one more thing i want to uh, one uh, spot point also i take directly press the spot point i take this linear point as you are able to see so i want to explain the auxiliary parameters so which are what are the auxiliary parameters this is the j j uh, defines the joint here is the option i can change it to linear circular and circular arc generally we change to linear to joint this one the position number and here the option choice and uh, here the position you are able to see the recorded position at that time what are the position this point having in x y z and rotation also there is a one option to change cartesian to joint nobody tell you during making the program i only explain now showing the current recorded joint position j1 j2 j3 j4 j5 j6 and if you want to show group number group 2 gun number gun opening value enter you are able to see the joint value also uh, remember in your mind uh, if we are going to show the position here you can see the user frame is zero user tool is zero user tool is one which we select in program so it if there shift plus coordinate you are able to see tool number is one user is zero and here user is zero and util is one both are match that's that time only this position move robot able to run otherwise don't run it's showing the mismatch alarm okay so uh, where we are this is the position which i have to explain and uh, this one is the speed you are able to uh, make it uh, from uh, 1 to 3000 mm enter and uh, this is the C N T fine and C N T here is the two choice fine C N T and C R so generally we are taking the fine fine means it's uh, reach the point accurately zero zero deviation if we are taking it choice C N T 
so you are able to make it from 0 to 100% CNT. After that, there are also some options if you want to take, you, you can learn when you go to expert level. Uh, these options also you can uh, use during uh, the programming. So these are advanced programming. So now we, uh, we have taken the one spot point. So this uh, denotes the motion type linear. This is the position number. This is the speed milli per second. This is CNT50. So uh, this is the spot instruction. This is weld ID. Weld ID means the spot number. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 number. Whatever you want to uh, assign, you have to assign. This is the schedule number. This is SD. SD denotes here the start distance. B remember start distance. This is P. P uh, defines the pressure. T pressure number is 1. SD start distance is 1 thickness t define the thickness i put here uh, whatever the thickness 2.2 enter okay s is uh, define the schedule well schedule weld id this is the well schedule s1 this is ed and distance uh, so these are the parameters which are having the spot point so uh, now one more uh, it's going to be long i just want to explain uh, what is the sd sd ed so there is one the data key you can see here the type and here uh, you can able to see uh, the register pressure pressure this is uh, the pressure which are there pressure one having the 3000 newton pressure in one we are able to change it uh, to whatever your requirement 2000 okay so now if we are selecting there p1 that time it's applying the 2000 if we are selecting p2 that time it's applying 3000 one so we go to direct and uh, here we make it uh, 3000 okay now uh, there are also more options you select the type this is the p1 and uh, one is the distance you are able to see the distance which is SD or ED it's uh, generally used for the before taking the spot robot gun movable robot arm or gun arm means a movable tip or fixed tip going how many mm offset before taking the spot automatically it's uh, open uh, take the position generally it's uh, we are taking the 10 10 mm according to your requirement you can take so if we are using ED1 SD1 that means gun open 10 mm before and after doing the spot robot open 0 mm robot uh, the spot position remains on the spot position if we are selecting the two means it's uh, uh, going to be 10 10 mm so this is the just for your knowledge uh, now uh, the program side completed thanks thank for watching my video